Hey, what's up, boys? We've been saying it all week. We have huge news. We've been lining up stuff, and here we are, 2023, at the PGA Show. That's right, we're out here at Demo Day and Fitting Day. We're gonna be walking around, seeing some of the new products, seeing all the new stuff. Enjoy this video. Yeah, so let's let's talk about that Cortec chamber real quick. So this is you know this is a, a leap forward for Mizuno in in really ball speed technology with a, the Cortec chamber. So we make it in two models. There's a Z model and there's an X. So the X model has just a little bit of head rotation to it. Both models are excellent. Even on the PGA Tour, I mean, we've had half of our tour players go with actually the STX model. We got hot metal in hand right now. These things are for, I guess, your mid to high handicap golfer, typically? Yeah, I, I mean, I, you can tell from the look of it, it's, it's, it's not a very game improvement looking golf club. There's not a lot of offset to it, but you're gonna get all the, all the benefits of a game improvement golf club, but it's, it's still very clean. It's very forgiving in that I just hit that super thin and it still came out straight, didn't get too squirrely, very clean. It does not look like a player's forgiveness iron at all. I mean, it just looks, Beautiful, thank you. Next up, we got the Hot Metal Pro. This is a little thinner top line, a little thinner sole, just a, a, a next step up, if you will. Thing is so good, I'm telling you what. If, if you're going for feel and you're going for performance, Mizuno's the way to go, that's, that's the only way. All right, now we got the Hot Metal HL. This is their newest lineup in the iron game, going for that high handicap golfer. Little slower swing speed, just gets the ball up more because the loft's a little bit higher, a little more traditional. So let's give it a whirl. It's a great looking iron, but it's it's so easy to launch up in the air. Yeah, it got and, and you know, there's we, we wanted to make sure it was is clean a look in that super game improvement category. Right. And it is. I mean yeah, I've seen just, those irons and those irons are usually atrocious looking. <laughs> they look hideous. They are big. But these are yes. not, I mean. That right there is like your typical player improvement iron size wise. When you hit this thing off the middle of the face, it comes off like you didn't even hit a golf ball. It's just unreal how soft these things are. The look speaks for itself. I don't even have to say anything about that. They're gorgeous. All right, folks, we're here now with John, R&D engineer at Mizuno Golf, and uh, we appreciate you spending some time with us. He's gonna talk to us about the new wedges, and they are, ooh, they're gorgeous. Yeah, so what we're looking at here is the T22 in denim copper. Um, that's been a really popular finish for us. Yeah. And uh, this is the player's wedge. Um, very small shape, thin top line, uh, looks just really good. Um, it's got the Hydroflow micro grooves, which we've been running for a few years now. And this new wedge, we're excited to talk about this one. We took S23 uh, a step forward, um, and this is now a one-piece forging. Um, executed with the same tech, where center of gravity and the center of the face, more consistent spin um, on off-center shots. Um, Really excited about this one. All right, folks, that's all we've got for you today. I really appreciate these guys. Tad and John have been an absolute blast, and the new products are incredible. If you haven't tested them yet, go down to your local fitter or your local Mizuno rep, get fitted. That's the key to all of this. They feel incredible, they perform incredible, but at the end of the day, each swing's unique and fitting's very important. So, anything else, fellas? I just want to thank Wedgie's Golf Company, and, and thanks for taking the time to come down and, and be with, with the Mizuno brand and, and us uh, you know, showing you all the technology that we have. Uh, John, anything you want to add to it? No, just thank you guys for what you do and uh, look forward to seeing the content coming out. Let's go. Love it. See you later.